It's the ten crack commandments. Why? Uh, uh. Man, can't tell me nothing about this coke. Uh-huh. Can't tell me nothing about this crack, this weed, and my hustling niggas. Uh. Niggas on the corner. I ain't forget you, niggas. My triple B niggas. I've been in this game for years. Uh, it made me an animal. It's rules to this shit. Uh-huh. I wrote me a manual, a step by step booklet for you to get your game on track. Not your wig pushed back. Rule number uno. Never let no one know how much dough you hold. Cause you know. It's rare when I get to spend one on one quality time with my dad growing up. So when I did, I remember it all. I made an effort to absorb all the knowledge, values and feelings in the short window of time that we had together. One philosophy that was burned into my mind around 17 is something he probably doesn't remember saying. My dad is not a violent man, he's the complete opposite. So I was shocked when he told me this. Be kind to everyone you meet. That's extremely important. But if someone crosses you, just once, you kill them. Yeah. I'm asked, real as they come, they feel it get numb. You think you got a little bust and now you can't get stung. I keep a razor blade tucked on me under my tongue. Don't let me have to tell these niggas about the city I'm from. It's Brooklyn, be the home of the hardest ever. Where the niggas don't aim, they just palm berettas and bomb whatever. So we don't move calmly, never. This for my niggas trapped in cells like salmonella. Look. You can tell that's a real quote just by how unelegant it is, but I live by it. I'm just gonna, so let's just get in, okay? And get- I guess the lesson is you never know what will influence your children. The reason I'm psychoanalyzing my oh. own childhood is to understand how I ended up on an island in Thailand with anger in my gut and the intention of learning how to fight till my body gives way. I guess I'm tired of people crossing me. It's vital to understand your strengths, but more importantly, your weaknesses. My greatest asset is my ability to learn. I'm not the smartest student in the room, but I'll keep coming back till I understand. I seem to think I know the best all the time and I don't think there's room for that trait in this stage of my life. And my independence. Yes, it's sometimes a blessing, but just because I'm completely self-sufficient doesn't mean I should isolate. This is hard. Physically exhausting, Muay Thai is pain, but the test is to come back the next day. 
to ignore the cut feet, the swollen knuckles and the weak ankles, to increase your speed, your precision and your grit, to throw so many right hooks and elbows it becomes second nature to you. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah. I said niggas pop shit all the time Me I don't trip cause they know I'm never lying Look in between the lines, feel like I lay in this prime Ha salam I lick em, I lick em, salam Peace to my slimes, peace to my crips Neighborhood police and they always on the shift Protect my bloods, look out for my cars When it's all said and done, we see the realest there was Who else if just not us? If you got this revolution, please stand up We ain't got no one to trust Time is running up, feel the burn in my gut And if you got the gut, scream fuck Donald Trump Real give a fuck, never have one to give Never will forget, probably never will forget uh, I guess that's just how it is And they still won't let the black man live uh, The energy surge through my veins when I flow Mentally, I can never be controlled No sympathy for foes, my enemies exposed But they remember me when I'm gone I say I was learning, gaining respect, feeling less like an intruder. Your ability isn't judged here, egos are low, everyone can fight. So it's your heart that's judged. The more power my body absorbed, the less aggressive I became. I let go of the anger in my gut. I felt lighter. I've always been an angry ball of pent up emotion, thinking the tougher, richer, stronger, more masculine I get, the less angry and scared I'll become. It doesn't work like that. I felt peaceful with purpose. I train, I fight, I ice, I repeat. Surrounded not by people I was above, but by people I aspire to be like. I felt almost complete in here. The male biological drive to protect and compete and to teach your body to harden and your fists to feel like steel was satisfied. Every man should learn to fight. Not for the ego, but for the soul. If you find peace in war, <laughs> You can find it in everything. And if someone crosses you, you need to know how.